Even during my field work in Ladakh, I discovered some stone tools in sites like Hunderdok, Fangdok, also in Tirsa Lake. And here what I found that the place names has given me, helped me to find these things like Hunder, you say Hunder. But when I have consulted the Tibetan dictionary, I found that Ladakhi dictionary, Hunder, the actual mean is Swangtar, the name. Swangtar means the emergence of early man. So when we started exploring, we found the earliest stone tools at Swangtar. These are the dogs. And then also in Tirisa, because that is the salt lake near that, we also found even in the Gaik. And Gaik was also mentioned by the Birbal Sani in 1936 when he explored that area. He has given some hint that in future, if you select some things, you may find that. And when the dating was done, we found all these things. Even in Jammu area also, we found very parallel to this uh, Borjom site that is Bathera. And Bathera means when we started starting the local language, Bathera means the workshop of stone implements. So we found a lot of Neolithic tools. And now it is known as the uh, Malpur. Even in Kargil also, so many tools were found. And Kargil is also a correct form of Kharkil. Khar means palace, Kil means center. This is the center of three palaces, Karche, Khar, Sod Valley, and also Budkharbu. 